Because here is Pink in action. That's a great video, isn't it? I, 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 I'm a fan of Pink. This is, ladies and gentlemen, Pink. <laughs> A video. <laughs> I'm learning to dance like the kids. They all do the. Can you just do that once more? What's this? Just... That's great. That? You want that? You want that? I like that. Yeah, I got some of that. You know what I'm talking about, girlfriend? Okay. <laughs> Hello, Pink. Nice Hi, to meet you. Hi. Nice to meet you too. Uh, thank you for coming on. You're now, very now, funny. Now your hair is blonde at the front, but you have a little bit of some pink at the back. Yeah. Okay. First time I saw you uh, in a video, I think you had all pink hair. Completely pink. And I assume that was where your name, the nickname or the uh, the stage name Pink had come from. Would that be right? No. Why were you given the nickname Pink then? You ever seen the movie Reservoir Dogs? Of course I've seen the movie I Reservoir Dogs. then. Um, Reservoir, Mr. Pink. <laughs> <laughs> Mr. Pink, Steve Buscemi. Yeah. He was the smart ass. He was sort of sarcastic. I sort of him too. And um, that was our favorite movie, it's me and film. my friends. And I was sort of the token girl, Who liked very the much a tomboy in my clique of friends. And uh, what's that on your tooth? That is a piece of jewelry of some sort? It's my diamonds. Are they real diamonds on there? Mm. It, the weird thing about it is when the light doesn't catch it, it looked like a bit of spinach I at know. first. <laughs> 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 now I see it's a diamond, it's a lovely thing. But initially I thought, should I tell her or not? I didn't... <laughs> <laughs> uh, didn't uh... <laughs> I do like to laugh, I'm sorry. Yeah, that's, no, don't apologise. I just wish I'd said something to earn it. Um, <laughs> now, you have uh, quite a lot of tattoos, don't you? I have a couple, yeah. And, uh, and they say things. What do they say there? This says what goes around comes around. Mm -hmm, okay. And then uh, recently I got a help button. You got a help button? A help button. That's a strange thing to do. Why, now, why did you do that? Because sometimes I need help. <laughs> You got anyone to talk to if you ever? <laughs> no, that's why I write songs. Down and confused. Uh, you write all your own songs? Most. Okay. Uh, you written your new one, this stupid girl's yes. one. Yes. Now this is a good song, eh? and it's quite Thanks. an interesting idea behind it. What what prompted you to write this song? I'm using easy examples to attack a general idea of a certain this mentality, this force-fed image that's pumped down our throats of you must be a size zero, you must have a certain handbag. Um, you must have a certain vocabulary and you must not think or contribute to the world because it's not sexy. So you're talking about this kind of the more superficial aspects of celebrity culture yes. as it filters down to the rest of the world? Absolutely. Okay, and you refer to which people in the video? Who, who are you? I don't name names. Okay, but... I don't think I need to because it's sort it's of everywhere. It's pretty clear everywhere. that it's Paris Hilton. No, it's not. It, I, as I said, I use easy examples to attack a journal idea. <laughs> 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 Uh, <laughs> uh, let's have a look at it. This is Pink's new single. as well. Thanks. Uh, so that's something you obviously believe in. That's something yes. you care about. Yes. Okay. Uh, I, I care about tolerance for diversity. Because you, you're kind of a different looking person. Thank you. Is, is this true? I read this and often things you read aren't always true. That uh, Prince William asked you to perform for him at a party or a gathering. He did. At Buckingham Palace or some mm -hmm. such place. And you declined. I did. Okay. So, so how did that come about? He was a fan of yours, presumably. Yeah, he wanted me to perform at his birthday party. Okay. And, and which I one was had, this? How old was he then? I think 21. Right. And I had heard um, 
through PETA uh, that he was oh, dear, who's, who, who's PETA? People for the Ethical Treatment of Animals. Oh, P-E-T-A. I Peter. thought you meant a friend of yours called Peter, Peter. who knew William. Peter. Pe Pe my boy Peter. Peter. My boy no, Peter. No, Peter. Okay, um, P-E-T-A. That he was basically publicizing his hunting trip in Africa, and I found that very offensive and um, not my style, not my gig. So, so I wrote you're him a an letter. Animal, you're an animal lover then? I am absolutely an animal lover. Okay. Unconditionally, and he uh, he does the fox hunting as well, I believe. Is that correct? Mm -hmm. Yeah. So presumably, you're well, he did. Him. I don't know if he still does. Okay. Uh, I, I didn't I, receive a reply. I don't like the idea of fox hunting. Well, that's kind of rude. You didn't get a letter back. I heard his father was going to write me a letter. I never got it. So you're not a fan of the royal family? Still waiting. <laughs> I'll put a word in for you. Um, now, I'm a, an animal lover. I have a lot of pets. Uh, my my oh, wife and I and good. the kids, we have a lot of animals. We very much love animals. Um, uh, you had a dog once with a very unusual name, I believe. Yes. Okay, uh, well, what was the name you gave your dog? Fucker. Okay. <laughs> Any particular reason? Oh, he, look, he is, that, is that fucker there? No, that's Elvis. I like the look of Elvis, though. He's gorgeous. So that's your current animal? I have four. Okay, you have four. And he's... Four rescues. Um, fucker was a Jack Russell. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> It's he a great name a because everyone feels fond of him already, don't they? <laughs> did you go? If it, love. Did you ever shout his name out loud in a park? I lived in Venice Beach, so I would take him out to the beach and let him run and run and run <laughs> on a Sunday. <laughs> and then I would say, <laughs> and the, everybody would turn around like I was talking to them. <laughs> and you'd see this cute little Jack Russell running. <laughs> <laughs> Mommy! Mommy! Uh. He was cute. My dad adopted him and changed his name to Fred, and he is a much happier dog. <laughs> I swear, he really is. He is. Uh, Pink, it's been a pleasure spending some time with your company, and you Pink. are going to sing for us now. I sure Pink am. is going to sing for us. Ladies and gentlemen, join me in saying thank you in advance to Pink. That was great. Thank you. Hey, you're a lovely person. Thank you. Nice to meet you. Okay, you got this already. Thanks to my guests, Sir David Attenborough, Gavin Henson, and of course the wonderful Pink. Joining me next week on the program are Sir Alan Sugar. Tamsin Gregg from uh, Green Wing, Anton Deck will be here, and we have live music from Gorillaz. But now performing Stupid Girls from her fabulous new album, I'm Not Dead, it's Pink!